This is a picture of coral reefs from over 20 years ago. And this is a picture of what they look like now. The reason that they look so white is because it's bleached coral. The coral is not dead, but when the coral is under stress because of their environment, the algae in their tissues are expelled, turning them completely white. Eventually the coral will starve and die if they're bleached for an extended period of time because they will never be able to gain energy from photosynthesis. But they can survive if they reclaim their food source. But this isn't the only thing contributing to coral reefs dying. There are also destructive ways of fishing such as dynamiting and and cyanide poisoning. Dynamiting is a fishing method that uses explosives to kill fish and, as expected, is terrible for the environment. It shatters coral colonies and kills coral tissues on the adjacent colonies. And then cyanide poisoning is used to stun and capture the fish while they are alive for live reef food or aquarium fish markets. Cyanide kills coral polyps and yeah, algae I'll turning right here. coral reefs into marine deserts. Well, I'm done. Hey, I am at the City College of New York campus and I'm going to go around asking people what they know about coral reefs. So this is what they used to look like and this is what they're looking like now. It's really bad. So what are your opinions? I could just like reduce like using like plastics and all that stuff because that's a, that is like one of the main deals. Yeah, I agree. And like factories, like less factories and I think dynam like dynamite like is what they're doing and it's not really like necessary. It just makes their life easier. Yeah. But like they don't think of like the consequences yeah, they don't. of everything else. Mm -hmm. But like they should just really like stay tuned. Yeah. The actual fishing. What is your opinion on the coral reef crisis? home to many animals, protect coastlines from storms and erosion, recycle carbon dioxide, and benefit humans and all life in many ways. Coral reefs are essential to our environment, so we should try our best to conserve it as much as we can, and with enough effort, maybe we could restore them. Number one thing you could do to help these oceans is to recycle. <laughs> Try your best not to use fertilizer because it eventually will end up in the ocean, polluting the water. Save as much water as you can while you're brushing your teeth. Turn off your faucet. Try to use friendly modes of transportation such as walking, bike riding. Don't forget to put on your sunblock, but use reef-friendly sunscreen. Spread the word as much as you can. Small changes can lead to big differences. That girl's know what she's talking about. Yeah. That